Hans Spellmer, a German surrealist artist, gained renown for his life-size dolls and erotic photography. His initial dolls, which distorted the female form with legs emerging from legs, emerged as a rebellion against the Nazi regime's pursuit of physical perfection. Belmer once remarked that the female body resembled an endless sentence, inviting rearrangement to reveal its true meaning through an array of infinite anagrams. Born in Katowice, Silesia, Germany on March 13, 1902, Belmer faced pressure from his father to work in a steel factory and coal mine despite being accepted to university. Despite these challenges, he persisted in his artistic endeavors and managed to showcase his work in Poland. However, he faced arrest on grounds of degeneracy under the influence of fascist Germany's strict control over art. He proceeded to pursue engineering at Berlin Polytechnic, but left in 1924 to pursue work as a book printer and later as an illustrator for Malik Verlag. In the same year, he made his inaugural journey to Paris, an experience that would significantly shape his life. In 1928, Belmer married Marguerite Schnell. Together with his brother Fritz, an engineer, Marguerite and his cousin Ursula, they embarked on the creation of a large mechanical doll named Doll Constructor from wood, plaster, glue, metal rods, nuts and bolts. Belmer documented the doll's various poses and stages of development through a series of photographs, ten of which were published alongside a text titled The Doll in 1934. In 1938, Belmer fled to Paris from Germany, where the disquieting and sexualized nature of his work was welcomed by André Breton and the Surrealists. At the time, his work was acknowledged in the art culture of Paris and, particularly among the Surrealists. This was because Belmer's photography and art referred to sexuality and beauty of women. In 1954, he met Unicism, who became his companion until her suicide in 1970. He continued working into the 1960s. In 1975, Hans Belmer said goodbye to this world and died from cancer.